Welcome back to another Basics Game Maker Studio tutorial and here we're gonna go with MP Potential so this is now for pathfinding still a one-liner of course it comes with some issues because it works okay so as you can see they are going through our obstacles which is pretty sweet but once we are doing a really nasty trick yes yeah, you can see we're getting pretty much lost so this function which i'm gonna spoil in a few seconds is pretty good for some uh, small uh, obstacles a tree or uh, well i don't know a house or whatever or a big stone where you just have some rectangles and then you can just go around it no e no problem but if you have some mazes or some hooks so this would be considered a hook in in my opinion so a thing which uh, you need to have a little bit more computation than boom it breaks so what am i referring to well this is called mp potential step or mp potential step object depending if you want to use solid object as your thing to bounce off to go around or specific instances so if you wanted to know that that was it <laughs> have a good one bye bye but if you want to know a little bit more stick around this is one up indie i am a developer so if you like what you're seeing hey why not consider sharing liking subscribing alrighty so a little quick recap so what we did so basically if you just open the manual you have the motion planning so this is part two this first uh, second video if you haven't watched the first one come on watch it because i'm gonna repeat some stuff and then you had the linear step step object or path or path object same stuff here but then it just says like mp potential but not linear and potential just means a very very easy thing so let's say whoa i did this video more than once as you can see so here normally this would be a straight line well <laughs> in my world this would be a straight line and now you have something which you bounce around and therefore you try to find a potential other way uh, to your target and this is basically the whole idea behind the mp potential so this is already a pretty decent uh, ai pathfinding pathfinding algorithm which is not giving you too much control you can but not too much and then you just say like hey mp potential step or step object depending which one you like so you need a target 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 then a speed value okay then or check all or basically your instance nothing actually new which i'm saying so for example what i did uh, here i'm just having my little walls and then they are flagged as solid and of course these are the same ones as this one so my stuff is already uh, working one thing how you can actually set this up and this is a global thing you can go and yeah this one you can say like mp potential settings and in a nutshell because i don't want to annoy you too much with that basically um an enemy has kind of a vision cone so this is represented by the blue lines here and then it can check out steps ahead so this is what it says and then for example um if it's just let's say have four steps ahead or 10 or 20 or whatever then it's like you can um in advance say okay try to go for an alternative route and then you got some parameters how much you can turn around what kind of step and what you do if you're stuck on one spot and this is pretty much it I don't want to go into details because i played around with that and it didn't bring the results i wanted to have so yeah <laughs> you complete completely uh, kick that out so one thing this is bonus content so for example if you want to do that with the path so this is what i did in the very beginning so you can actually see the path um, then what you do is just say create a path and loop it through the alarm because i guess alarm is the easiest way create the old path create a new one start the new path with a speed value and then i don't know this stuff should be easy peasy if you haven't watched my other things on uh, videos on pathfinding or just general path stuff link in the description below also and here you have uh, the xg and yg basically this is the same stuff this is just your target then step size kind of like a speed value but not really 
don't want to go into some details because this is bonus content and then the factor factor just means uh, well if you have a line between your target or your your enemy and your target this would be a factor of one but because we have an obstacle we have to go around so basically this is kind of doubling or tripling the way how we can go around and therefore this factor just means like hey uh, can we achieve this goal from here to here with a factor of two or three and then it will adapt to that so here you can tweak around with those values also but this is of course playing around i would so say four to five is okay i maxed it at 30 and plus and then it kind of broke so don't go over 30 and yeah so for example if we just put our guys in let's say a more tricky environment like this it will kind of break well for most of them a few of them for example this one has an easy way from us to the player but the other ones will get hopelessly stuck so let's zoom out and as you can see oof, here we are getting stuck here we are getting stuck and of course here the mp potential settings these are the things which you can change dynamically sometimes they go and get better results but didn't, didn't work for me so i played around with those values and it was never a really satisfying let's say uh, all rounder settings and therefore i just skipped on this one and this is what we want to do in the last video the number three so doesn't really matter where i place them they're all competent so once again this is what we're going to do this is going to be in the tesla of <laughs> path of Dick. Yeah, for game maker which is pretty sweet and just in a few lines all right as you can see ah no more bugging no more trying and looping through infinity for something something we are going in the best optimal way through the grid which just a few lines also so this is going to be easy busy set it up but of course next video so look forward to that Alrighty long enough video have a good one one up indie